Hello everyone, today it is time to check out the Latvian entry for Eurovision 2018 and I gotta start off by saying that it feels a bit weird to know that this is the song that Latvia has picked because the amount of times that I've listened to Just Fine by Sudden Lights which came second in their selection is just, you know, through the roof so time to adjust to Funny Girl by Laura Risotto and uh, yeah, we'll just get right into it It's a nice kind of like bouncy tone in this because the piano is so deep and then right as the percussion hits the piano drops. Percussion is so reverby as well. Very mellow bass line that goes very deep, it's rolling very deeply. Build up with the plucking. It's quite an exciting string arrangement going on here. Strings are very dominant and, and hard hitting in this. In contrast to most entries where the strings are just in the background. I like how in the chorus, like the percussion is driven, driven harder with the, with the string kind of style to make it bounce. Very mysterious sounding track in its instrumental, which is pretty cool. It's a quite a good melody going on here in the chorus, and uh, like the lyrics are pretty <laughs> well, they're very sad in a way. And how that works with the kind of sensual and mysterious instrumental. It's quite a cool combination. Like the instrumental is quite simple in a way. They they reuse the same ideas throughout. And here they drop everything and like, I feel like the vocals kind of make it stand out a bit more, but the instrumental feels a bit... Like, I get that they want to make quite a restrained setting to fit with the whole atmosphere, but it feels a bit simple as just reusing the same ideas throughout. And the structure is quite just up and down and going through, but yeah, okay, yeah. It's a decent little entry. Let's talk about it. So as I was saying, kind of the uh, interesting aspects of this song is definitely in, in the instrumental. It creates a very nice atmosphere going for it. It kind of matches quite nicely with the lyrics in a way. Like the lyrics are very, very sad, but when you put them on an instrumental like this, it becomes quite of a unique and charming tone to it. And it's it's exciting, it's interesting. It, it like it captivates my interest. And that's a really cool aspect of it. The vocals sound quite decent. I think the, it won't be any problem live performing this. I have like I have many just decent impressions from this, but I'm just not feeling that it's all the way there. It feels a bit too simple in its instrumental or in its arrangement in general. It feels quite like a lackluster structure. Not that I'm expecting the songs to have very unique structures because most of them kind of have the same pattern going throughout. But this one kind of feels like you could do something additional because you don't really grasp the attention that much in other areas. So maybe if you played around a little bit with the structure, it could have been more interesting. 
Uh, right now it feels like, you know, three minutes, it feels like it goes on for three, for three minutes, but it feels a bit stale as it just goes, okay, here's this part, here's this part, let's go, it's like a nice flow throughout the sections, but it's just this part, this part, and then we go back to this part and we repeat this part, and then we get back to the first part, and then we have a little break where basically nothing is happening, it's just the vocal kind of highlight, and I get that this kind of part kind of has the dramatic tone to it, it's like... It, it's the it's the whole atmosphere of hopeless of a hopelessness and it, it feels like yeah okay the instrumental is not backing it up anymore it's very hollow it's very it's very uh, sad in a way and uh, I get that it's it's quite a cool idea in that in that regard but it just feels like something is missing throughout the song that just really drives home the authentic punch in the in the entire message and an entire delivery of the song and I feel like that's where this song kind of loses its its mark. And, well, maybe I'm a bit biased because I would have loved to see Southern Lights go instead, but it's just my general opinion on this song, and uh, that's all there is to it. Do you agree with me or do you disagree? Leave your opinion in the comments, and uh, until next time, take care of yourselves. Bye-bye.